Looks like Meghan Markle's mom, Doria Ragland, won't be spending Christmas with her pregnant daughter and son-in-law, Prince Harry. A royal source tells ET that Doria isn't expected to spend the holiday at Sandringham this year, the royal estate in Norfolk, England, where the royal family traditionally celebrates Christmas. The source also says that there are no current plans for Doria to move permanently to London, England, and move into Frogmore Cottage with Meghan and Harry. Last month, Kensington Palace announced that the Duke and Duchess of Sussex are moving out of their two-bedroom home at Kensington Palace and into the ten-bedroom cottage at Windsor Castle. The construction underway, at Frogmore, is taking place with the hopes it will be livable and move-in ready before the baby comes this spring, the source says. It's likely that Doria will spend extended vacations with Meghan and Harry, but a permanent move at this stage is not in the cards. Last month, a source told DT that Doria was expected to spend some of the Christmas holiday with Meghan and Harry, and that it was expected that she would receive an invitation to attend church with the royal family at Sandringham. Doria's quiet dignity and grace at the royal wedding has earned her enormous respect from Meghan's new in-laws, the source said at the time. The source also noted that Harry is enormously fond of his mother-in-law, and that she's been spending time at the couple's home, including two extended vacations this summer. Meanwhile, despite reports of tension between Harry, Meghan, Prince William, and Kate Middleton, the four all attended Queen Elizabeth's Christmas lunch at Buckingham Palace on Wednesday. Royal expert Katie Nichol recently told DT that the foursome will definitely spend Christmas together, despite any lingering drama after William originally voiced his concerns about Meghan when she first started dating Harry. The four of them will be at Sandringham for Christmas Day, hosted by the Queen, but of course, the Queen and her family, perhaps, in many ways is no different than other families, there are feuds, there are rifts," Nicole said. For Christmas Day at least, William and Harry are going to have to bury the hatchet, put a few wobbles behind them. It's not like they're not talking, they're still incredibly close as brothers, but, there have been fallouts, there has been tension. Christmas is a good time for goodwill and forgiveness, so let's hope we see the princes do just that," she added.